It seems like we're seeing the last big sell-off before update 7 comes on Saturday with prices beginning to absolutely plummet as we speak. In this video, we are going to talk about why the prices are absolutely plummeting and what you guys should be doing to prepare yourselves for update 7, as well as go over all these new leaks that we've been seeing in the past few days. Remember, if you guys want to hear about this stuff first, you guys have to join up on my Discord. My Discord is absolutely the best place to hear about these price changes when they are happening so you know when to buy or when to sell. We're also doing a daily huge giveaway every single day this week, so you guys are not going to want to miss out on that. Besides that, remember to subscribe to the channel and like the video. Let's get right into it though so you guys know exactly what's going on. Alright, so first off, as you guys can see, I have a ton of diamonds right now. The main reason for that is because I did sell off a whole lot of my huge happy computers. As I began seeing people panic sell, I traded a lot of mine to my other accounts though, so don't think I sold all of the ones that I had in here the other day. Most of those went to my other accounts so they could grind even faster. But I did sell about 15 of these huge happy computers because the panic selling is already beginning to happen. And I'm predicting at the 6 p.m wrap update that we are going to see the wrap value of the huge happy computers drop by at least probably 600 to 700 thousand and honestly that's a really conservative number considering the prices that we're beginning to see right now as you guys can see in the second plaza i went to we found some selling for 900k under wrap and honestly this is pretty common you could find this in most of the trading plazas right now and also in the last wrap update, we did not see a change to the huge happy computers wrap price at all. So that's usually the indicator that deflation is beginning to happen. So yeah, now just two days ago, we have seen conditions like this just happen where we saw some insane price drops that we've actually never seen before in Pet Simulator 99. And honestly, right now, this is looking like the same kind of deal. Because before the wrap price even fell, we are now seeing prices go even a million below wrap, which means that we're probably going to get a super huge drop. And we could probably expect the same sort of situation that happened to us a few days ago. Now, this is a great opportunity for a lot of people to make a lot of diamonds, especially if you have multiple huges to sell now. A couple days ago, the huge happy computer prices bottomed out at basically 20 million diamonds. It is pretty impossible to say when we are going to see the bottom of this little deflation period. I definitely don't think it's going to be long, just like the last one. So probably around two to three wrap updates, but it really depends on the people in the market. Again, we really just don't have anything to spend our diamonds on right now. So all the people selling their huges probably aren't buying anything else. So all those diamonds that they get from selling are going to have to go somewhere. And of course, I'm predicting that they buy it back and we're just going to see the same inflation that we saw before. A lot of times before an update comes, people begin to sell off some of their stuff just to collect some diamonds to hold just so they're prepared if they need it for the new update. So honestly, this could have been the cause of the current deflation slash panic selling that we're seeing now. But of course, most likely all it is is that we are seeing people panic sell because prices are getting so high and they just want to lock in some of those gains that they've seen from investing in the huges. During times like this, you basically want to sell your huge for as close to rat value as possible and then wait for the prices to stop falling for the huges and then buy as much as you can. And you're basically going to be able to get more huges than you started out with using those diamonds that you got from selling. One thing to note that when I am buying back the huges, I usually try to go for ones that are higher level. So if the huge happy computers and the happy rock prices are similar, I'll usually go for the rocks instead because it's a lot easier to find the higher level versions. And those higher level huges are a lot more useful for your team because they can just do more damage straight up as well as they are much easier to sell if they are higher level. So that's just a quick tip if you are planning on rebuying your huges after selling them. Overall though, I'm still sticking to my guns that I think inflation is still going to go pretty crazy after this update just because of the introduction of all the new stuff that we're about to see. It just doesn't seem likely that we aren't going to make more diamonds in this update. And as you guys know, more diamonds in the economy equals higher prices. It's pretty much just inevitable at this point. 
I have yet to see any leaks or any news about anything that Big Games is putting into the game that is going to be a true diamond sink for the economy. So basically what I'm saying is I do plan on buying all my huges back once the prices begin to stabilize a little bit. But let's actually get into some of those leaks because since my last video we have seen quite a few new leaks about this coming update that are very important and can definitely affect how you make some of your purchasing decisions within the market. First of all, we have the most recent leak that came out today. It actually came out like two hours ago at this point. Now, a lot of people are speculating that these three new little things right here are actually going to be the new pets that we're going to see in the brand new exclusive egg. This right here is the OG banana pet. Then I guess this lucky block in the coin would be new pets that we haven't seen before. So they must have some specific theme for an exclusive egg going on. It is possible that they introduce these pets through some other means within the game. But it does seem likely that this is going to be what the new exclusive egg is going to give you. And because of this, investing into the current exclusive egg, the jelly egg, would be a good investment. As we are going to be seeing that egg removed from the exclusive shop. The only other thing I can think of is these being introduced if you are participating in the hunt within Pet Simulator 99. But overall, I'm just taking this as an introduction to a new exclusive egg that we are going to see. So I probably will invest a into a few more jelly eggs just to be safe. Seems like a good purchase to me for now. Now another leak I did see is this new exclusive daycare ticket. So obviously this daycare ticket is probably going to be used for the new huge anti-tannic daycare. So everybody that has been investing their diamonds into the regular daycare tickets are probably sad by seeing this. But we can expect this will be some sort of either drop from breakables or something that you purchase in the exclusive shop. All right, and now moving on to the enchantment leaks that we've seen, we actually got this picture of what seems to be a red lucky block book. So this could be some sort of like super lucky block or even some new thing that we haven't seen yet. But whatever it is, it looks sick and honestly seems like a cool enchant idea that could actually be really good and potentially be a replacement for stuff like the regular lucky block book, the boss chest, or the chest mimic. No one really knows what this is yet or how much it costs, so we won't really know till the update and we are able to test it. But besides that, it looks really cool and overall seems like a decent idea. We'll definitely be testing this when it comes out. Next, we actually have the Super Magnet Book, which is something we've been asking for for so long. Obviously, we're not sure if these two enchantments are real or not. These are just common leaks that I've been seeing going around on Twitter. The Super Magnet enchant would be awesome, and I'm sure so many people would be buying this thing. I would assume it's not going to be too many diamonds, because if all it does is give you the strength of a few Magnet Books, then... It's not really anything too crazy because we already have the ability to use something like this. But either way, I'm probably going to be buying one of these things if it really does end up coming out. Definitely something we need within the game. If we do believe that these enchants are going to be in update 7, that means that the current exclusive enchant books are going to be removed from the shop. So investing in the super shiny books or the boss chest mimic might actually be a good move at the moment. So if the prices of those enchants do go down with this current deflation that we're seeing with the happy computers, then it'd probably be a great time to pick those up. All right, and then the last of the leaks we have are these new ultimate icons that we see here. This one kind of looks like a tsunami or some sort of wave ultimate that's probably going to end up just like washing all the breakables away. Seems like a typical ultimate ability that we've seen so far. And then next to it, we have this purple, like, flaming, like, kind of shining ultimate. I'm not sure what this is. I've seen some people say something about it being an item drop ultimate, but that doesn't really make sense to me. That's not like any of the other ultimates we've currently seen. So I guess we'll have to wait and see what this one does. But to be honest, most of the ultimates that we've seen in the game are pretty mediocre and actually don't provide much value at all. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the leaks. Some pretty interesting stuff. I'm definitely excited to see this new update on Saturday. While I was showing you the leaks, someone did try to sell one of these for almost one and a half million diamonds below wrap value and nobody bought it. So that's just a sign of how bad of a little deflation period we're probably going to see right now. I am predicting that it will go back up before the update just because of this new huge daycare that we are expecting as well as the increased diamond drops that we're going to see 
from the 25 new areas being introduced in the new update as well as those 25 areas of course we get another rebirth as well we're going to be doing more and more damage so I'm just hoping we have a good diamond sink that can stop that inflation that we would be seeing. Now we're just going to quickly go over some of the stuff going on in the market. We've seen a pretty consistent increase in the prices of these exclusive eggs. With the emoji egg of course being the cheapest of the last three recent eggs that we've seen. But because of that leak with the banana pet being introduced to Pet Simulator 99. I can expect that we are going to see a new egg so I think it is a good time to be investing in the jelly egg because after the new egg comes out this price will probably be closer to the prices of the emoji and then the valentine's eggs. In terms of the enchantment books we've seen the chest mimic keep increasing in price despite everybody thinking that this is finally going to crash at some point. The chest mimic has defied all odds and has now reached a whopping 401 million diamonds. I guess we will see in the new update if the chest mimic is really reintroduced. And if that does happen, we will probably see this fall a bit. But currently, it's still just the best enchantment in the game. So with people making so many diamonds, the best enchantment book in the game being this expensive isn't too crazy. The price of this will probably just depend on whether or not they introduce it back into the game. The boss chest mimic has increased in price quite a bit. I'm, I'm not sure if this is tied to the new enchantment book leaks that we've seen. Because if this does get removed from the exclusive shop, it's most likely that this will increase in price. So the most recent price increases for this might be due to that. But I'm guessing we'll have to see. And then also the super shiny hunter book has gone up as well. It is now 51 million diamonds. Seems like a useful book, but I don't think I would ever spend 51 million diamonds on this. The increased odds for the shiny pet is just not significant enough to justify a 50 million diamond difference. The lucky block book actually has gone down a bit. This is probably due to that red lucky block book that we did see in those leaks that I was showing you. So some people probably think that is going to replace this book. I don't really like that logic because I think the lucky block book is still going to be good for what it is. I don't think they're going to introduce just a book that is the same thing but just a little bit better. So selling the regular lucky block book just doesn't really make sense to me personally. And then the massive comet book is pretty much just at its same price. Almost as much as the lucky block now. Unless this sees a buff in the new update I'd probably just sell this book at this point. It's not going to be useful for a lot of people's setups now. Especially if we get another book that is like the lucky block. Because then we're going to have like five of these books that you can choose from. And currently the massive comet is the worst of those. Besides all that though we probably will see the huge potion increase in price in the next day. Because of that huge party that we're going to be seeing before the new update. And then of course people usually begin buying these cocktails for the update. So they can fly through the new levels as fast as possible. That's another thing to consider. As well as all of the lucky egg stuff usually goes absolutely crazy during the first few days of the new update. So stocking up on these will probably be a good idea for now. Because people are going to want to get those new stat pets so they can fly through the new levels as fast as possible. But that is pretty much it you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. That was a lot to cover. Let me know down below what you think about those leaks and what is going to change in this new update. If you want to know exactly when this deflation is over as well as the new meta within the new update. Make sure you're joined up on the discord. A huge pet is being given away every single day on there. Thank you guys so much for watching and peace out.